All right, I call this my mechanical jewel thief charger. And uh, this is the same motor I showed in my last video. It's a one magnet and a bifiler coil. But I eliminated the transistor. And it's just a reed switch operated motor now with a little uh, uh, tuning magnet right there in the front. And then there's Maggie going. And it's driving off of one AA battery. And that's why I call this a mechanical jewel thief charger. But with the leftover coil that was in there, because you don't need two coils with a pulse motor that's driven by a, a reed switch, I took the extra coil and I ran it into a bridge rectifier with a capacitor. And now I've got a charging point on the other side. So anyway, this was the way it ended up. It's just... Uh, an extremely simple drive circuit with a reed switch that's activated by the magnet running around. It turns the power on, energizes the coil, and rotates the magnet. Then the extra coil that was on there ran through a bridge rectifier and a capacitor to smooth it out. And now I got a charging point on the other side. And I call this the uh, mechanical jewel thief charger. And anyway, I thought I'd just show you this. And this is the voltage on the charge battery. And watch the capacitor voltage climb up and I take the battery out of it. That's the capacitor charging up. That's that little capacitor right there, the blue one right there. And there's the voltage going up on the cap. And that's that coil right there, that unused coil that was in the transistor circuit. It was the trigger coil. And I just turned that trigger coil into the charging coil. And some of Bedini's circuits, they actually add a third coil that's like that. And so that's what I've done here, basically. But I just run it with a reed switch. You just use two coils. You can see that went on up to seven, seven volts. I'll plug this back in again here. Yeah, went back to 1.30. It's extremely low amperage. It's in the microamps, so it doesn't do a very good job of charging. So I don't recommend it for that part of it. But the um, the light part's pretty cool. The fact that you've got a AA battery here that's uh, running a, a little pulse motor and through the flux line uh, connection here, it's uh, rotating that magnet inside Maggie there. It's a round neomagnet. Causes an induction current and makes her eyes go. And uh, pretty simple, but pretty effective. Um, this little reed switch is a Radio Shack reed switch, and they have a tendency to burn out if you put too much juice to them. But when you're running 30 milliamps out of a AA battery, they last a long time. So anyway, that's the little project I did today. That's the mechanical jewel thief charger circuit. No transistor.